Today I am going to explain you the principle of the free energy engine. But first I have to tell you how the conventional electrical engine works. I will use the computer fan for the demonstration. It's very simple to disassemble. You have just to remove this white ring. Then you can open the fan. Basically, the engine needs the magnetic field for its operation. In the conventional engine, the magnetic field is generated by the electromagnets. Those electromagnets must have a coil on it, and the coil is needing the electrical power. But what a waste of energy using the electrical power to generate the magnetic field? With no electricity, it won't run. So I'm going to modify this electrical engine to the free energy engine. This engine has four coils generating the magnetic field into four directions. This direction, this one, this one, and this direction. So why not to replace those four wasteful coils with four permanent magnets? The crappy black magnets wouldn't work. But the powerful neodymium magnets, for example from the hard drive, can completely replace those useless coils. So we won't need the electricity anymore. Now I am going to use the magnets instead of the electrical coils to power the engine. I will put four magnets into the directions exactly where the coils are pointing. And now watch. The engine is operating and it needs no electricity, just the magnetic field of those magnets. When I remove the magnet, the engine won't operate. I'm putting the magnet back and the engine runs again. Without any missing magnet, the engine won't operate. There is another prototype. I have mounted the magnet using the sticky tape. One magnet is missing. Now I am mounting the rotor into the engine. And the last magnet. And you can see the engine running. The only disadvantage of this engine is that it cannot be controlled electrical way, so the only way to stop it is to remove the magnet.